guys what's happening, it's me and my Aaron right now I'm at a very, very special event, it's gonna go off Look at these boots right here I'm sure you can tell what it's about Predator has been released, it's new, it's updated but more than feels in it, Big Man David Beckham is here and So first of all I want to say a big shout out to Luke Broker for sending me all of this gear making me look fly as hell and also want to say a big shout out to Adi as well for inviting me to this event As you know what my channel is all about, it's all about experiencing football culture and I brought you guys along with me and right now we're going to experience it in 3, 2, 1 As I said in the intro, they're bringing the Predator back and you can't bring a boot back without obviously showing the history of a boot and what better way to show the history of the boot than with David Beckham's stamp himself. Look over here, we've got the ones he wore here in 1999 where he won the treble with Manchester United. We then obviously move on over here and he's obviously got what he's played in, uh, England versus Colombia. Again, look at these, he's obviously got Beckham number seven on the boot, absolutely sick. The next one here is this, what he wore for LA Galaxy. I'm sure you guys remember this silo. Uh, the second, obviously, MLS Cup win that he done in 2012. Absolutely sick. If you look here on the side, he's obviously got his children. Let me just focus. Brooklyn, Romeo Cruz, Harper. Yeah, that was kind of obviously the end of his career. We're gonna move on over here. And we've obviously got the signature David Beckham football boot. Now, this one he wore in 2007. Uh, obviously with uh, Real Madrid, as you can see, Beckham wins La Liga, which is sick. Obviously look, his David Beckham logo is on there. And you know there's more, because David Beckham had some serious moments in his career. So let's move on and see what else we've got. And this one is one of my favourite boots. I'm not going to lie, I had this boot myself. Simply because of him and Zidane, it is obviously this printer right here. And as you can see, he's got Brooklyn, he's got Madrid. Uh, he's also got Romeo and he's also got Madrid as well and this is obviously the signing of when he joined Real Madrid. There you go, that's the picture right there. Absolutely sick. It's moments man. Moments obviously make a career and that's how you leave your legacy behind it. We all know that David Beckham has a sick legacy. We move on over here now and we've obviously got here. This is a special moment, a crucial moment. I understand why he kept it but for me I probably wouldn't. But it's absolutely a sick boot nonetheless. Obviously the red card he got in 1998 for England. Let's see if I can zoom in. So there you are, that's obviously the red card he got. He got it in these boots here. And yes guys, if you're wondering, these are David Beckham boots himself. He's obviously brought them in for the launch of this event. We move on now and obviously another one. This is the big one guys, this is a big one. <laughs> The pair of boots he announced his retirement in. Absolutely amazing, amazing for great for Beckham himself. Uh, we move on and see what other iconic boots are in the place. Uh, we've obviously got another boot here. We've got his England debut. This is the boots he wore on his England debut. Again, this is the Predator. Absolutely sick. Look at that. And there you go, Bex. Man like David Beckham in the building. I can't believe I am here experiencing the history that is in this building. Not only that, let's take it a bit modern and let's show you some of the latest silos that have been brought out by Adidas himself. There we go. if you then go and buy that. The next one is the white, the triple white. And obviously he had to go in for that. Why? Because obviously he played for Real Madrid and that is all about his time there. So even just the reflective free strikes, 
Also, he's got the key moments again on the inside of the football boot of some of the dates that he's obviously had with Real Madrid, which is amazing, which is sick. And come on, you can't complain with a triple white boot. It's sick. I mean, that credit art, if I could get my hands on it, oh. It would be amazing, absolutely amazing. So yeah, that's about his time at Real Madrid. And the next one, obviously, is the trainer, which is all black, it's triple black, obviously, which shows his time at AC Milan, but also shows his time at PSG. And I know what you're thinking, but PSG is navy blue, of course, but they can't put blue and navy blue in one trainer, so they obviously also decided to go with all black. Now it's sick, it's all about street rain. You know what I'm about, I'm all about obviously mixing fashion and football together. And I think that silo is sick. Even just a few ideas that he's come up with, he's obviously chosen the Predator Accelerator, which was his favorite boot of all time. This is all displayed on the documentary, which I mean, I'm sure you can see it. It's probably on YouTube somewhere, but yeah, we just saw it now. But now we're about to move into seeing David Beckham come onto the stage himself. And he's obviously gonna describe and talk to us about the boots himself. So I've got to run, I've got to go, and I'll see you in a minute. So there you go guys, that is the Adidas Predator launch. If you like this video, smash the like button. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Join the LA squad. It's lit over here. And last but not least, big shouts out to Luke Roper for sending me this jumper. If you want to buy any products from them, the link will be in the description below. And again guys, you can also follow me on Instagram, at Lamar Aaron's Frost, on exclusive behind the scenes content of all the events I go to. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm Lamar Aaron, I'm out.